So today is my first day of going to our recovery class at church. Um, it's a recovery group for more than just drugs and alcohol. I actually don't have any issues with drugs and alcohol. I smoked cigarettes for like seven years, but God delivered me from that. And I did drink when I was a teenager, but that really only lasted for like two years. So I'm going because uh, I, I deal with a lot of fear and anxiety issues and also uh, insecurity, self-esteem issues as well. And I know that that is not the way that God wants us to live, not having those things in the back of our minds. So I'm going to go to this meeting. And even as I'm going, I feel a little anxious. And I don't know why. I mean, anxiety is such a liar. So I'm a little nervous. I am, I like literally just pulled out of the driveway. I'm so nervous. But if I'm nervous, that means that I'm doing something right. I'm doing something right, another step towards dealing with my issues. And so, if you guys are watching this, just keep me in your prayers. And I'll keep everyone updated on how it goes and kind of my journey with that. Because I am realizing just from the more people that I talk to, I'm really realizing that this is an issue that a lot of people deal with. And, I mean, anxiety is, is really, it can be really powerful. And so, and it's kind of hard to describe. So, but I know that we can overcome. I know that we can. And it feels better talking about it. It does. You probably can't tell, but my face is all flushed and just feel nervous. So I'm looking forward to the day where I don't have those nervous feelings anymore. But I know that there is going to be change. I just got to keep pushing for it matter what. Because I deserve it. I'm a child of God. I deserve it. So I just have to keep reminding myself that and standing on the truth that God is with us and covers us. And that he said that he would never leave us. And, you know, the devil tries to lie and intimidate us, fill us with fear have to put it down before it gets a hold on you. And I let it get a hold of me. I did. I let that fear be in my mind. And now it's time for it to go. So, a little nervous on my way, but I know that God has a plan, and I cannot wait to share it. I can't wait to share my experience and give somebody else hope. So I'm not taking any medication. I'm not doing that. I believe in God wholeheartedly that He is my strength. And I'm believing Him that, that He is my comfort. And I have to just really come to that realization and not listen to the lies. And it can be kind of hard as a single mom and I mean, I live with my parents as well. I could talk to them about it, but there's some things that you feel more comfortable talking about people who are going through the same kind of issues as you. And sometimes I feel alone. Like I'm, I don't really have that many people to talk to about it. Even though I know people are going through it, I've just never really been open about talking about it. And it's not something that I can you know, share with my son. I never want to put my burdens on him um, in that, that aspect. Those are not things I want to share with him now. I mean, he's five. So, off I go.
Irish pub. If I continue to go to these, and I will definitely keep everyone updated on how it's going. So have a good rest of your night or day whenever you're watching this, and, and just be encouraged as I am right now. Even though I'm, I'm going through the beginning steps, I know that there is hope. And so don't ever feel like you're hopeless. Because God gives us that hope. He is our hope and our strength. And it doesn't matter, even though the waves, they seem so strong. The winds pushing. But God is our hope. God is our strength. And we're not alone. So it I just it helps me to just take some deep breaths. Just be still and know that God is who he is. So just be encouraged in that if you're dealing with these same kind of issues. Just be still and know. Just relax your mind. And just calm. And it's so hard to do, especially if you're in the middle of an anxiety attack. It can be so hard, but that's what we have to do. Just be still and know that God is God. I'm excited for the days ahead.